The eustachian tube is surrounded by four key muscles, the tensor veli palatini, the tensor tympani, the levator veli palatini, and the salpingopharyngeus muscles. The function of opening the eustachian tube has been attributed to each of these four muscles at some point in the past. However, it is now widely accepted that opening of the eustachian tube occurs solely as a result of the function of the tensor veli palatini muscle. As we have mentioned, the eustachian tube remains closed at rest. It is during actions such as swallowing, yawning and sneezing that the eustachian tube opens. Closure of the eustachian tube occurs as a result of recoil of the elastic fibers within the eustachian tube, as well as extrinsic forces exerted on the wall of the tube by the surrounding tissues. In relation to the opening of the eustachian tube, the tensor veli palatini muscle is the most important of the four. For this reason, I want to focus on its anatomy. The tensor veli palatini muscle is made up of two muscle bundles that attach onto the eustachian tube. The more lateral of the two has its origin at the greater wing of the sphenoid, just superior to the eustachian tube cartilage. The muscle descends until eventually it converges into a tendon that wraps around the hamulus of the medial pterygoid lamina, and eventually inserts into the palatine bone via the palatine aponeurosis. The medial bundle of the tensor veli palatini muscle is called the dilator tubi muscle. Its origins are directly on the cartilaginous portion of the eustachian tube, and its fibres also descend, eventually blending with the lateral bundle. The primary function of this part of the muscle is to actively dilate the eustachian tube, and it should now start to become clear how important the tensor veli palatini muscle is in the opening of the tube. Any disruption to the structure of the tensor veli palatini muscle, either at its origin, the sphenoid, or at its insertion, the palatine aponeurosis, will inevitably affect its ability to open the eustachian tube. 